So I'm so glad that Aday and Amanda are in colors, namely, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Aday is in fall pink. Amanda is going to be in fall green. This is a customer top braided cotton acrylic sweater knit, cute little pockets in the front, a three quarter tab sleeve with like a little, um, <clears throat> almost what appears like a little horned button on the side. And there's a new color in all of these, but when you see all the colors, the fact that there are so many colors is very telling because that means that what started in two or three or four colors has become so popular that we've built out an entire family palette. So I'm gonna take you over here because what's happening tonight on this, the wind down, the final 30 minutes of our fall fashion festival here at the Q is that everything on air and online is three or more easy payments. So. It's a great opportunity, in this case for $9, 10 bucks, um, to get home one of these. And uh, you know, the tunic, we don't even need to discuss really, because if it stopped here, I'd be like, yeah, she's cute. I'm not tempted to order it for me, but it's cute. But the fact that it's a tunic, I get like five colors. So here is what the colors are, <coughs> excuse me. Dark chocolate, uh, warm gold, Spice Orange, Fall Wine, Fall Pink, Fall Green, Fall Red, wait, down here, Lapis Blue, Bright Plum, love that. This is gonna be a camel that we call Chestnut charcoal gray, black, and then in the navy. So again, I wanna bring out a color, front and center. It's a little easier to see the details. Let's try, excellent choice, Sean. Thank you so much. There is chestnut. All right, let's walk through this together. Um, for starters, this is a sweater knit. This is a cotton blend sweater knit that you can wear all year round, because there's no wool in this, it's a cotton acrylic. Can you see? this kind of herringbone knit stitch that continues up the shoulder and then down almost bateau neck style, almost like a little herringbone stitch. Then the sleeves are three quarter, they are not convertible, you can't undo this, but it's darling. It's a little roll tab with kind of, I called it a horn button, but it's not really, it's more like an enameled grommet button. Then the front pockets are these cute little patch pockets that appear on the front. There's a split side so that when you sit, when you move, there's a breakaway so it doesn't hug and stretch around the hips in a weird way. And it goes without saying, the call out of this whole thing is that it's a tunic, which everyone is doing. There is not a single designer brand. There, there's not a single place that is not doing tunics because they speak to not only what is chic and what is kind of trending and happening, but also obviously it's a huge figure flatterer. It's a completely um, friendly way to do a top that also disguises, frankly, the bottom that a lot of us don't want to show. Close to 2,000 of these ordered. The big story today were a couple things. We just debuted Navy. Um, all of these colors that are top rated now you can pick up one if you've never tried it or more if you have for nine dollars and change on the easy pay the other thing we just wanted to call out you know one of the things that we have been saying is really happening is that sweater tunics is a must-have i don't know if you saw that little fancy thing that we started the presentation with but one of the trends that you will see if you google trends fall 2015 sweater tunics T-shirt tunics, of course, but sweater tunics. And I just want to call out on Monica and Miss Aday, will you join us, how long this tunic is? Because sometimes they pretend to be a tunic, but they barely touch that little crease in the buttocks and they barely give you full cheek coverage. Um, Aday and Monica are great examples since they haven't belted theirs and you can really see how luxuriously lean 
the silhouette is in this and yet of course it's not thick and it's not bulky so it doesn't add girth and it's certainly something you could wear in spring as much as in fall and it's adorable seen here in all these different ways but I keep going back to the way Monica is wearing it not only because I love this boot and I own it and I'm wearing it and it's coming up and it's a freaking out item but this idea of a riding boot with a sweater tunic and then just insert your own little ankle pants skinny pant legging skirted legging there's your outfit and you have not um, spent a fortune so and you can add an eternity scarf or a cool necklace or an adorable little fedora hat and that's fall you know, so I think this is a really cool one and I do love um, how cute and how semi fitted it is. It doesn't feel too boxy or baggy. I've got an update for you. So let me walk back here. 4,000 ordered. Black and chestnut are going quickly. The, um, the entire palette is customer top rated other than the navy, which is new. <clears throat> so we'll take you through colors again in a second. And if you're at all eyeing up something called warm gold, that is now officially last call. Extra large through 3X only in this color that we call warm gold, which I think that is beautiful because it's this fantastic true blue mustard shade um, that with a black legging or a charcoal legging and a great knee high boot or a suede ankle boot would be fierce, just completely fierce. Obviously, I'm wearing mine with the Obi belt because I want to call out that this is really the soft sweater knit version of a t-shirt tunic. So anything long, you can belt. Um, let me take you through colors again. We talked about warm gold. This is dark chocolate. This is our spice orange. I think the pockets are so cute on this too. Um, this is fall, hang on, fall wine, fall red, okay? There's that. Then, um, bright plum. This is fall pink. And then fall green. Um, that's what Amanda's in. Two shades of blue. One is the customer top rated lapis. One is the new navy, which I wanna call out. Navy is going quickly. I'd also like to call out that I remember growing up and my mom telling me, honey, you don't wear blue and black together. And now everyone is showing blue and black together. So I just wanna comment though, a lot of people say navy is a great alternative to wearing black. Navy is also great with black. So if you have a black legging or a black jean or a black trouser pant, that would be terrific. Speaking of black, obviously I'm wearing it. This is chestnut. It's kind of a richer, caramely, um, tan, it's very limited. The warm gold just sold out. I love the charcoal. Yeah, charcoal gray going very quickly. The pockets, I don't laugh at me, but I just think they're not only really cute, um, but I'm, I'm always looking for somewhere to put my lip gloss. Like my lip gloss is sitting over there right there on a table, just cause I didn't want you to see the big lip gloss thing. But um, I'm always looking for somewhere to put like a little something. And so I just love having a pocket, but it's, it's been placed on there to, to look like an accessory to the garment. It's not purely just a function thing. So I think that's great. Warm gold is sold out, so no more warm gold. We brought in over 11, oh, you're the best. Over 11,000, here's my lip gloss. And look, there you go. Um, 3,200 remain, black is last call. Chestnut just sold out, so that's, Wait, fall pink is last call. And fall wine is last call. So those are almost to go. That is gone. Um, you're seeing chestnut on Monica. I would just like to say, since she has a very harvest color palette on right now, mm -hmm. how great, sorry for the hanger in your face. <laughs> how great would that be with chocolate brown boots and chocolate suede boots and maybe a chocolate um, OB belt because there's another version of the one that we had in the show tonight online that comes in a deeper chocolate brown. Um, just cute and it's cute and it's easy and I just if you're new to the queue I also just want to say sorry that um, Denim and Company is our lifestyle brand and there's obviously it's very popular it's been around for quite a while the price points are spectacular and it's a great landing strip and place to go for workhorse basics like um, 
t-shirts, <clears throat> sweater knits, cute lifestyle wear that's not over stylized, that is not super trendy, great core, classic basics, but in this case with a little bit of a twist. And this one I think is so top rated because it takes this idea of a tunic, which everyone is showing and doing and also loving, but it doesn't feel too progressive doesn't feel too contemporary. Um, little roll tab sleeve, a cute little preppy patch pocket. You can funk it up if you want, all based on the accessories and the footwear and the leather jacket or the belt or the necklace that you put with it. But then likewise, this you could put on with a cute denim skirt or cute little white shorts and a little lace up boat shoe. So it really is, it really takes on the personality of what you wear it with and how you style it, which I think is, is really great. Fall wine just sold out. So let's do colors one last time. Dark charcoal just sold out. Um, black is almost gone. So here's where we're at. This is fall red. How great would that be for holiday too? I just love the length of this, right? They got it so right, because it goes like long, like it's long. Um, what? A day said she'd wear it as a dress. It's, you wouldn't. We're all super jealous that a day would wear it as a dress. That a day could even wear it as a dress is something that we actually love to actually hate her for. Okay, so here is, what is this? Dark chocolate. That's sold out, don't look at that. This is fall green, going quickly. This is fall pink. This is last call. This is spice orange. This is black, lapis blue, the new navy is almost gone. They're all 10 bucks on easy pay. And then this is the plum, busy on the phone lines, final 1,000 to go around. Um, the easy pay on these things ends at midnight because the whole fall festival ends at midnight. I'm just gonna keep my lip gloss right there, the same. Um, coming up, already 500 pairs ordered. I own them, they actually, are in my closet when I'm not wearing them, which is right now. They are a Mark Fisher over.